What's up everybody? Welcome back to another episode of Talking Whiskey. We are your host. I am Josh Daniels. And I'm Colin Bingham. Let's drink this. Hey, let's do it. Hit that intro. <laughs> As you can see, we are not in the Talking Whiskey Studios. For some reason, we're out here in a job site. I don't know why, but but here we are anyway. All right, so Colton, what did you bring today? We've got some Angel's Envy Kentucky Straight Bourbon finished in port wine barrels. That's fancy. It is fancy. That is fancy. It is fancy. Nice. All right, Colton, today I've got Second Glance. It's American whiskey. Uh, they make it out in California. Uh, it's, it's finished in, in wine barrels, just like yours. So that, that's pretty fancy. Yeah. It's pretty cool, man. This is going to run you about 45, 50 bucks, depending on, on where you are. And uh, what, what about yours? Uh, it's the same, 45, 50 bucks. Okay. So they're, they should be pretty evenly matched. Uh, big shout out to Open Spigot for helping us line these two up together to yeah. where we got these. I check them out on Facebook, Open Spigot. They're in Udawal, Tennessee. Got a great selection, a very friendly staff. Oh yeah. And, and definitely, we definitely recommend you guys you guys checking that out, Open Spigot. Well, hey, uh, let's talk a little bit about this bottle. That's a pretty cool bottle. It's a, it's, very, it's a very elegant bottle, the back. It's got these angel wings on it. It gives it a nice three-dimensional, from the third dimension look. Yeah, it's pretty cool. And uh, you know, I got like I would I would call this a nondescript bottle. You know, I mean, I, yeah. honestly, it 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 looks like kind of like a, a perverted wine bottle. I mean, it, it looks like it's not really. This is a whiskey bottle. Yeah. And quite honestly, it, with this bottle and this label, I I probably wouldn't wouldn't no, buy. No, I would I would have passed it over. I wouldn't even know it was there. I mean, a lot know. of a lot of whiskey tries to have that history, that you know, 1800s, that old grandpappy's recipe, but this one just this one does not apparently. Yeah, but hey, let's. You know, let's just see what it tastes like. So, yeah. so here we go. Let's let's open right. these things up. Woo. Okay, I got a little bit of a wine smell to this, Colton. Yeah. I really do. It, it smells like uh, like a maple, maybe like a maple wood, and uh, a little bit of fruit, like uh, like black cherries. A little bit of cherry. A little bit of cherry. That's pretty cool. Right. Interesting. What do you got? Uh, same thing. It, you can. It's it's kind of got that 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 wine smell to it. Got that fruity smell, the the sweet smell. It's like okay. a uh, syrupy kind of vanilla smell. With okay. A little, little hint of fruit. All right, excellent. All right, well, hey, let's right. let's Pick give it up. a pour. For it, oh, cool. It's, it's got a little got a little, little book on it, and and I done that, told that, you. But if we keep doing this bit, we're gonna need more snooters. All right, all right, here we go. It does have that classic bourbon taste, and it's got a um, little bit of caramel. Oh, honey, that's got honey to it. Yeah, that's got a little bit of honey to it. Right. And um, the alcohol is is muted, and it's kind of in the back. That's so, good. Yeah, so caramel, honey, uh, classic bourbon spice, and then the alcohol in the very back. Right. Man, not bad, not bad. So what do you got? Man, it's 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 good and sweet, uh, like syrupy sweet. Yep. It's just fruity. Okay. It's kind of maybe maybe a little bit of tartness there. A little bit of tart coming okay. through. Um, it's really smooth and and laid back. Like the alcohol, the alcohol is kind of muted on this. This is real drinkable. Look, man. Look, all I'm saying is this. I mean, you you got this magical fairy that comes into people's houses, steals right. their kids, takes them off to some island out out in the middle of nowhere, and robs them of their future. They never grow up, and all of this just to entertain him there's one man there's one man in the whole world that knows this guy is evil and he's after him and trying to kill him and yet he's the bad guy i know right yeah i know i know peter peter pan and disney is messed up man good all right colton well let's uh let's switch this stuff up all right you get my second glance and i'll get your angel's envy let's see what it smells like here Good. Yeah, it smells it's good. Like, it's like this is like it's a like buttery toast. Buttery toast. Buttery toast with with jelly. Yeah, man, I got a little bit of. Uh, God, it smells like it's a sweet smell. It smells like raisins and uh, some nuts. Maybe yeah. some toasted nuts. Yeah, maybe. 
Yeah. All right. Cool. All right. Well, here. Let's go again. Cheers. Hey, cheers. Everything to, in moderation, especially moderation. Woo. Okay. Ooh. Yeah. That is that is nice and, and smooth, and I can definitely taste. Uh, I taste the fruit. Mm -hmm. That's sweet. That's sweet, like a little bit of uh, bitter, bitter, like the baker's chocolate. Yeah. Like bitter baker's yeah. yeah, like I baker's got, chocolate. I got, I got that yeah. from it. Yeah. Yeah, like a, a, a semi sweet chocolate. Yeah. yeah, not bad. This is actually really, really, really good. What do you got? Uh, it's, I, I see what you're saying. The alcohol is muted, yeah. and and it's it's got that bourbon spice. That's the first yeah. thing that hit me. It's it's spicy. Well, okay. a, a little bit of mouth burn more than a more than a going down burn, which is a that's that's new. All right, Colton. Well, you know this is going to be a little bit of a hard one. Uh, you got New Age. Uh, versus, uh, I mean, it's a pretty established brand. Yeah. I've heard of Angel's Envy for a very long time. I've heard people talking about it. Yeah. All right, Colton. So, if you walk into a liquor store and you only had enough money to buy one of these, would you be walking out with the Angel's Envy or Second Glance? I would have to take a second glance at Second Glance to figure out what it is. But I'm not saying this is bad. It's just not. It's it's not where Angel's Envy is. Right. Not yet. I like the sweetness of the Angel's Envy. Okay. I like absolutely. the sweetness and the mellowness. That second glance, it doesn't really look like a whiskey bottle. I would probably not take a second glance at it. I would probably just scan over it and just not not see it, right? But the Angel's Envy, I, uh, by word of mouth, I've heard a lot about it. Yep. And now I know why. You got yeah. that sweet, you got that nice classic bourbon taste, but it comes on real smooth and it finishes, it finishes uh, sweet. Yeah, yeah, and uh, you know, good job, Angel's Envy. I will, I will definitely pick up a bottle at Open Spigot of Angel's Envy, and uh, and I will definitely enjoy that. And and good, yeah, excellent. I'm gonna pour a little bit of Angel's Envy. Yeah, I'll have some of that too. I'll wait for you. Here's we'll, to the winner. Here's to the winner, Angel's Envy. All right. God, that's so much money. That is good. That is good. Hang on. No. You're gonna have to. Burning. If you like what you see, please, please hit that like button. If you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. And like always, all the comments in the comment section below is extremely appreciated. And check us out on Facebook, on Twitter, Instagram, and coming soon, podcast. Really? That's right. All right. Even he didn't know about that. Hey. So, until next week, folks. Stay classy.